independent candidates ride on Chimisa's coattails. Independent candidates for Mount Pleasant and Harare East constituencies in the capital are rallying voters to support former Citizens Coalition for Change CCC leader Nelson Chimisa by voting them into parliament. The by-elections will be held on April 27. The seats fell vacant after former CCC legislators Fadzei Mahir M.T. Pleasant and Ellen Markham Harare East resigned from the party and parliament in solidarity with Chimisa who ditched the party citing infiltration by ZANU-PF. Independent candidates Nason Mamats M.T. Pleasant and Rapa Fadzo Chaser Harare East have now hinged their campaigns on Chimisa's popularity to secure victory. Mamats and Chesa have declared that they are behind Chimisa. Chimisa has, however, distanced himself from any political party or movement since his resignation from the CCC in January this year. Mamats will battle it out with George Meshavev of ZANU-PF and Brian Tiki for the Mount Pleasant seat in the by-election slated for April 27. Chesa will contest against Kevin Mutim Banyoka of ZANU-PF for the Harare East constituency. New Day established that Mamats and Chesa are riding on Chimisa's popularity by putting his face on their campaign posters to solicit for votes ahead of the by-elections. In an interview during the weekend, Mamats said, I am contesting as an independent and for now Chimisa is also an individual. I would have put any other person on my campaign posters but I chose Chimisa because I like him. No comment could be obtained from Chesa as her mobile phone was not reachable. A CCC faction led by Jameson Timber has pledged its support for the independent candidates. The CCC did not field candidates for the by-elections. CCC spokesperson Promise Mkwanonzi said the party supported the independent candidates to ensure democracy finds its way in parliament. We did not field any candidate under the CCC because CCC candidates have been blocked in the past. Mkwanonzi said. In our view, it is imperative for the citizens to vote for the CCC candidates to ensure that ZANU-PF is stopped from gaining any further ill-gotten political ground. He added, Parliament is a platform for democratic debate but if ZANU-PF had not recalled our MPs in Parliament we had prevented it from acquiring two-thirds majority. There is a need for people to be represented so that the democratic movement in its totality continues to prevail in its liberated zones. Self-proclaimed CCC Interim Secretary General Sanjizo Chibango snatched the party from Chimisa and recalled his legislators, senators and councillors, triggering by-elections. ZANU-PF has gone on to gain a two-thirds parliamentary majority through the by-elections. Chimisa has accused Chibango of being a ZANU-PF proxy, a charge ZANU-PF denies. The CCC has since split into two factions, one linked to Chibangu and another associated with Chimisa's fanatics. Please like, comment, share and follow this channel for more information or updates on news and entertainment.